Hey guys, what's up and welcome to another exciting DJ Cafe tutorial. So uh, today I'm going to show you guys how to fix the GPU CUDA problem on your Adobe After Effects CS6. And it's actually quite a simple fix. So let me show you what I'm talking about here. So a lot of you have an NVIDIA card, you got Adobe After Effects CS6, but oh no. You go up here, go to preferences and previews. And under your GPU information, you're getting this. Your GPU is not available, incompatible device or display driver. And as you can see, no CUDA version here. So, I mean, what's the deal here? I mean, I got the GeForce GTX 560 Ti. That's quite a new card and it's a pretty powerful card. So you try to go to GPU and it's grayed out. So I'm gonna show you guys how to fix this problem. Cause to be honest, Adobe is stupid and lazy because it's quite a simple fix. It's it's honestly, uh, I don't understand why they don't have all the cards supported, but uh, let's get started. First, make sure you have your card updated. You have an NVIDIA card, I'm assuming, because um, CUDA is, of course, only supported on NVIDIA cards so far. So go to the NVIDIA website. I mean, you don't need me to show you how to do that. Go to Google, type in NVIDIA, go to the website, update your card. Just make sure whatever card you have, you have the most up-to-date graphics driver for that card. That is number one of importance here. When you do that, your card's installed, you restarted your computer, come back here, and this is what you're gonna do. And uh, just to let you know, most, like pretty much any card in the last five years, even maybe even more support the CUDA if you have the NVIDIA with the latest drivers. So when you do that, go to my computer, local disk C, program files, Adobe, Adobe After Effects CS6 support files. So this is your default directory for Adobe. Scroll down to the bottom or before that, make sure you sort by type. So all the files are in type and find Ray Tracer supported cards. Look for that in this directory. So Ray Tracer supported cards. This is the problem right here. We're gonna open this up and you're gonna see these are the only cards that support the CUDA and After Effects CS6. And you're probably like, wow, why? I mean, there's only a couple cards here. I mean, come on, right? Look, out of the 500 series, they only got the 570 and 580. This is literally laziness and stupidness on Adobe's part. So to get your card to be recognized by Adobe After Effects CS6, first know exactly the type of card you have. To do that, go to start, run, and just type DX D-I-A-G, DX Diag. Press enter and you're gonna get this screen right here. Just go to your display and boom, right here. Your chip type, that's the card that you currently have in your computer as long as you have the drivers installed. And you'll see here I do the version and blah, blah, blah. So the chip type, I have the GeForce GTX 560 Ti. So if I wanna fix my CUDA problem, now the important part here is to add your card in numerical order, because what you're gonna do in this open notepad is add the name of your card. That's as simple as it is. You see what I'm talking about? Adobe's lazy and stupid. So just make a new line here by going to the end of uh, the last card and pressing enter. And like I said, numerical order. So I have the 560, so that's clearly gonna go in between 470 and 570. So I'm just gonna literally type it in or you can copy and paste it. I just like to type it. So GeForce GTX 560 Ti. If you have the Ti versions of cards, capital T after the number one space, capital T, lowercase i. And for me, that's it. Depending on what you car, maybe you have the GeForce GTX 450. So in between 285 and 470, GeForce just make sure this is a capital F, sorry. GTX 450, and that would add a 450 card. So after you add your card, just make sure you save this file, close it, you can close that, and it's there, it's still there now. So now open up your After Effects, and if all went well, After Effects will now recognize your card, which is ridiculous because it should have recognized your card in the first place. Go to previews under edit and preferences, GPU information, and oh, look at that. CUDA is now just magically recognized by your After Effects program because you as a human being typed in the card name. You know, why couldn't Adobe just do that? But uh, 
So you can see now you can select GPU, make sure your texture memory is, is maxed out. Obviously you want it to use as much as your card supports and that's it. I mean, that should fix your problem. Um, so uh, I hope you, that uh, helped you guys out. I hope this tutorial helped. I hope um, you guys can edit your stuff now, use ray tracing, and uh, thanks for watching. If you liked it, like the video. If you have any questions, just uh, leave a comment. Thanks, guys.